Hello and welcome to the channel. Happy Father's Day. So um, we have another, you know, video for you guys today. Um, we have a actual picture of the Ford Ranger unmasked, unleashed. So let's go ahead and uh, check it out without any more wasting thy time. All right. So this is the uh, 2024 Ford Rangers Raptors US back inspired with absolutely no camouflage. 2024 it's not even supposed to be released until what 2023 usually it's you know but what's been happening that companies have been scrambling trying to put out as many cars as they can before the um, gasoline ban in 20 uh, 2035 so you you're gonna see this a lot happening with most manufacturers because the way they work is they have to be a few years ahead of when they design and everything. So that's why you've seen a lot of companies have been refreshing their cars a little bit too early, um, maybe two, three years or less than that, um, because they only have a limited amount of time to kind of like implement those cars and put them out, etc. Because um, they get planned way ahead, like a few years ahead. Um, from the design stage to, you know, what the car is going to, you know, look like and if all that stuff way ahead, way, way ahead, a few years ahead that they make them and then they just start testing, 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 and then they'll start, you know, leaking footages here and there. But anyway, so this is the uh, 2024, as you can see here, it looks really nice. I'm sure it's going to be really expensive next to the Bronco. I wonder if that's a new no, that's not, it's not, but yeah, it looks super nice, but you know, anytime you want to buy a car in this market, it's just, you're going to be paying a lot. So let's go ahead and do a comparison to the, I don't know if this is the, yeah, this is the 2024 Ford Ranger Raptor US back. Absolutely no camouflage. Big thanks to Bobby. Thanks, Bobby. Check out the huge grill and the separate bumper in the front. You can also compare it to the Bronco. You could, so I don't know if this is the Bronco R as well, too. Um, but that Bronco looks so badass. The only problem with those is those EcoBoost engines are pretty trash, in my opinion. At least the 2.7. I wish, I don't know. I wish they can just put the uh, the V8 backs in these trucks. That's what they, that's the bread and butter. The V8s, and they sound amazing. They're terrible at gas, uh, <laughs> terrible at the gas pump. But who the hell cares? Who buys a V8 and worries about the damn gas price? You don't. If you have a big car, you don't give a shit about gas price. If you have a supercar, any of those cars that are just ridiculously priced, you don't give a shit about gas price. You know, because you can, if you can afford a Ferrari, you shouldn't be worrying about how much it's going to cost for you to fill it up at the pump. Because one of those wheels are like 10 G's or if not more. A brake pad job, $2,000, $3,000, dollars 4000 So the cost of maintaining that vehicle is just astronomical. So people that have these big trucks and, you know, big horsepower or whatever, they don't give a shit about gas prices. They don't give a shit. I, don't, I sure as hell don't give a shit about gas prices if I have a V8 car like that. Because I already know what it's about. I already know. Those things are gas guzzlers. So I, for me, I would prefer a V8 versus the EcoBoost engine, whatever. So yeah, there's a huge differences between the previous Ranger and this Ranger. They got the big old Ford. You know what it is? It's kind of like um, reminds me of the um, the M150. I don't know. The designs look very very similar. They have this big 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 <laughs> open opening in the front with the big old words ford ford built ford tough but not quality or whatever i'm just throwing shade right now but, um yeah that's my my only complaint is that uh it doesn't have the v8 i know that it's running at least the the bronco r is running a three a 3.0 eco boost engine um I'm assuming it's the same thing for the uh, for the for for the F for the Ranger Raptor, uh, but I could double check. Let me see. Yeah, the new Ranger is also going to be running with the um, three-liter EcoBoost engine, 
but I have not heard. I think the only ones that we've heard so far that's being recalled, it's the, I think it's the 2.7 EcoBoost um, that I did a video on that's being recalled. Um, not not all of them. It's just very well. They're getting investigated, um, but nothing from the three liter EcoBoost engine. So we'll know more. We'll see what happens. But so far, from all the things that I've heard, the EcoBoost engines are pretty trash. Um, but we'll we you know what we want to know once the trucks start coming out and seeing putting them in people's hands and seeing what's you know what's what and seeing how good they are if they're reliable or whatever if they're not but anyway as always make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already and have a good day